I'm so sorry. I did not mean to hit you. Get that Welcome back everybody to some more Subnautica. So they updated the game with the so-called Altera Science update, which gave us a few new items here. One I am looking for, in fact, right now. But this is the biggest new item. This is a propulsion cannon taking Half-Life to the next level, and it's going underwater. So you can grab fish, grab any small object, and obviously propel it with this thing. So hey, we can pick up this little guy, and what can we shoot him at? Let's find out here. There's nothing really around. Okay, let's shoot this boo boomerang guy if we can. This is this is actually really hard to aim, and this guy's flying away. All right, you know what? Just get out of here. There we go. He's gone. <laughs> so yeah, this is probably the biggest update here. Here, do you want this? There you go. You can have it. Oh God, what what is he doing? Actually, can I pick him up when he has that? Let's find out. Come here, come here, buddy. Don't 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 go back to your den. I just want to grab. Oh shit! I I stole it. I stole it. I didn't mean to steal it. I meant to steal you. Here, take that. Oh shit. Okay, here, I want to steal you. Please, please, please work with me. Okay, there we go. I got him. So it can pick up quite big objects, as you can see. This guy is pretty damn big. Oh, shit, my, my oxygen level. I, I, I forgot I'm human. I need to go get oxygen. Hold on, buddy. Let, let's let's take you for a ride. I will now turn you into a bird. Goodbye. Oh, my God. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. And there he goes. He's totally fine. He's just going to go away. Okay, so I'm looking for a workbench fragment. That's that's the one thing I want to showcase to you guys. There is a few more things I do want to showcase in regards to the sea moth. Uh, we'll, we'll check that out later on, but I do need to find a workbench fragment, and I'm going to assume they look like the sea moth fragments, which was what I just picked up now. Just a big, essentially, bin that you pick up from the ground. But I don't know. I gotta look around and find this workbench fragment to spawn in the workbench, which adds... I, I would say it's crafting, but not really. It's more like upgrading to weapons, so I'm really intrigued to see what they added to this. I, I I know there's a heat knife. I mean, it's a, it's a heated knife that essentially one-hits creatures, which is really cool. Okay, this is getting ridiculous. If this... Is, yeah. I'm... Okay, these are all Seamoth fragments. Look at how many Seamoth fragments I've found before I even found a workbench uh, fragment. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Oh, God. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Don't, don't die. Please don't. Okay. Jesus Christ. I forgot. I have to breathe. I keep forgetting that. That's kind of important when you're human. Uh, there's another fragment down here, probably a sea moth fragment. I don't know if they look the same as uh, workbench fragments. I hope they do, because that's really what I'm looking for right now. But maybe workbench fragments are deeper? I don't really know. So I've never used this terraformer, and it's pretty damn cool. I, I thought I'd just make one just to try it. Essentially, you just grab material from the earth. If, if you didn't know, this game does have, as you can see, deterioration of the earth, which is really cool. Uh, I, I really wish they did more with it, because you can see it does a lot, and then I think you can just, yeah, you can add it, as long, as long as you have the material, you can add it to wherever you want. And I now made a penis for this thing, look at it, how, how nice. But yeah, you can just dig down, I mean, look at it, you can keep going if you want, I don't know how deep you can go, but you can totally turn this game into Minecraft, essentially. The central dark matter reactor will reach a state. In T -10. Oh. Oh, it's gonna explode again! Let's watch it. This is the coolest explosion ever if you've missed it. Uh, I might actually get hurt here. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Ah, ah, there it goes. Oh, yes. Look at that wind. Holy shit, there's things flying out of the. Uh, Jesus Christ! That is the most awesome explosion ever. If you didn't know, I had to make a new game because of the update, unfortunately. And look at even the underground, there's like things. It's just really dirty now, and dark. That's so cool. Hello, Billy! Subnautica's version of Billy, how are you doing? Are you guys doing good? I like you guys. You guys make me feel safe. Because I don't think... Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, where the fuck did these come from? I'm tripping out. There's... Did you just spawn these? What the hell is going on here? I'm so confused. Ooh. Ooh, whoa! Okay, I should probably not be in here, but I'm gonna be anyways because it looks really cool. And I have a lot of health left. There's really not much in here, I don't think, though, but it is beautiful. Oh shit, 30 seconds of oxygen. How did I. Okay, I got, I got up through here. There we go. Well, it was nice seeing you, Mr. Jellyfishes. I will see you guys later. 
I'm starting to think it only spawns at the mothership because I've been looking around a lot of the shallow areas and a little bit of a deeper areas like the red areas and nothing has been there. Oh, the lag is real right now. Uh, so I'm going to head over to the mothership, look around there for anything. What the hell is this? Oh, wow. It's like a... It's a, it's just a... Wa I've never seen that. It's just a jet that spurts you upwards. That's actually really kind of cool. Whoa! Whoa, what the... Fuck! Why would you spawn this right in front of me? God, do you want to give me a heart attack, you stupid fucking game? Oh, no, 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 go away, go off. Oh, come on, dude. Come on. <laughs> they ate you. I freaking ate you. Think you can beat me? Well, I got a Cyclops now, bastard. I'm going to try and use this and hopefully combat it. I don't know. I don't know if it might attack this as well. I have no idea. We're, we're, we're gonna learn right now. Oh, uh, they, they, I did, I should mention now that they did update the lighting and a few of the visuals in this thing as well. So, if it looks a little prettier to you, that's probably why. They also added, um, I guess I gotta go up to the other ladder, uh, an upgrade station to this uh, actual ship, and there's upgrade modules. I don't know what these modules have. Yeah, I obviously don't have any of the upgrade modules for it, but you can upgrade your ship now, from what I understand. Oh, and doors close. So that's that's nice, because those weren't closing before. You can also change the color of your ship as well. Um, it looks like you can only pick from blacks, can you? Oh, oh no, there we go. Now we got the red, green, blue. Uh, let's, let's just do a pink ship, you know what? It's, it's gonna be beautiful, you guys will love it. Uh, we're gonna do all pinks. And I, I need to go outside and see what this thing looks like. Perfect, done. <laughs> yes! Don't fuck with my, my Cyclops. Look at it, it's so beautiful, it's perfect. Alright, back in we go. Let's go look for this damn fragment. Oh, oh, oh no! Oh, come on! Oh, okay. He, he avoided me. Is is this too big for you? Um, that actually horrified me. <laughs> where the fuck did you come from? Alright, I think we're okay. Now I just need to figure out where, where the entrance is. I think it's like right over here somewhere. I'm so sorry. I did not mean to hit you. How could this happen to me? I made my mistakes. I am so sorry. Yeah, right here is where you can get up now. I just gotta park it kind of right here, but I don't want to get it stuck on the thing as well. There we go, that should be good. Whoa! Um... Uh... Um... What? Why? Why am I... I am so fucking confused. How the fuck did I get all the way over here? Oh, god damn it, I hate you, game, sometimes. What is that noise? That is, a, that is a horrifying, like, look how, you cannot see anything this far out. Oh god, I am horrified. I just, I just want to go home. Okay, you evil sub, why would you do that? Is it because I touched it, maybe, or something? I don't know, I'm, I'm hearing things, so. It's freaking me out, I don't like noises, but we made it to safety. Now, now I can just loot, I hope. Get out of here, you demon spawns. Get the fuck out! <laughs> I'm starting to realize with the head crabs and now this friggin' gun, this is basically... Half-Life 3. So, is Subnautica... Half-Life 3 confirmed? Is that really what this is? Because I, because I don't know. Go. The fuck. Away. There's too many- Oh god, this is where I almost died last time. This is actually where I died last time. Alright, let's keep going. Oh god, it's- it, Yeah, it hurts me up here. I'm not supposed to be up here, but I'm going anyways. Go the fuck away. Uh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Loot it. What, what the hell is this? A battery? No, I don't need a battery. I need... I need the damn blueprint. Oh, man. Can, can you par... I didn't realize you could go up this. This is so cool. Oh, hey, no, 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 no. Get the fuck out of here. Okay, please. First aid kit, I guess that's better than nothing. Oh, you can parkour this. This is... Wow, I, I, I missed a lot when I, was, when I was checking out this part of the ship. I think this is where I came up from the other spot. So I gotta fill all those holes in with the welder. Oh, pick up power upgrade module. I probably should need that. All right, we're not going to do this, actually. We'll just deal with the radiation, because I have a radiation suit anyways. Uh, and the shakingness just adds to the fun of it. 
Okay, well, there was absolutely nothing on that. I don't really know where else we could go in. Wow, wow. I like I like slow-mo fall there. That, that was majestic. Uh, I guess we're going to go back to my sub here and maybe go deeper. These things can go deeper, by the way, now as well. So I think the maximum before was 300 meters. You can probably go double that now at least. Now, I did get some sort of power upgrade. I was, I'm just wondering if I can put it in here. Um, power upgrade module. And yeah, that's this should be... Oh, there we go. Power efficiency now 200%. Look at that. I found myself my first sea moth. Sorry, not sea moth. Cyclops upgrade. Interesting. Oh, this is horrifying. I can't see shit. God, those things just came in the frame. Um, yeah, you can see that... Oh, it's a tight fit, but we got our, our way out of the mothership. But now, we're just in pitch black darkness. I, I'm gonna go down here and see what's down here. But, I'm a little scared. I... Oh. Okay, yeah, that, that just warns me that collisions to hull will do damage. I know that. No big deal. Uh, we want to go deeper here. We're... Oh, okay. Oh! I thought they told me, I guess I need upgrades, because they told me, or sorry, they didn't tell me, they they had it in the upgrade thing that you can go deeper with this now. I guess you can't unless you upgrade it, I'm assuming, with the modules, so you need some sort of depth module, but we can, of course, use the wonderful sea moth to go a little deeper, well, a lot deeper. You can go as deep as you want, I think, with the sea moth, which is great, because this little thing's awesome. My favorite ship in the game. Okay, where the fuck are we? Okay, that, that is a volcano. Don't want to get hit by it. Oh, shit. Okay. Uh, this is a really cool place. I, I've been to these before. It's been a while, though. I'm just... I need to find that module. I, I, I don't think it would be this deep, but I've been surprised before. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Come on, guys. Just just, just, just play nice. Just play nice. I, I come in peace. Please. Please, I am not that... Tasty, I don't think. Okay. I didn't want to do this, but I spawned one in. Because I do want to figure out what the workbench does, and I am curious about, about it right now. But I did notice a little typo in the description of this thing. A piece, spelt wrong, of a workbench technology. See, so we're going to drag this over here in my fragment analyzer, and hopefully when it's done analyzing another fragment, we'll get ourselves our workbench. Okay, so the fragment analyzation was successful, and now we have the workbench in here. We can spawn it. Let's spawn it right in the middle. This is actually how they showed it in the update, so I'm gonna put it right here, too, because that looks like a pretty damn good spot for it. Now, I'm kind of excited to see what this thing can do. Use workbench. Ooh. Okay, so you can upgrade three things so far. A knife. I don't actually have a knife, but I think because I'm using them... I, well, essentially a cheat. It's going to allow me to do it anyway. So we got a diamond blade. Let's spawn everything in and see what they do. Um, there we go. A diamond blade. You don't. There's not really any any change to it. I don't think. But uh, it is a diamond blade. And then we have a heat blade as well. And this one is red. This one looks cool as hell. Uh, if we go into my inventory here, we can put it on. Let's put it on one. There we go. And we have, oh, that actually looks exactly the same. So did they not update the animations? Or, oh, oh, there we go. Now it's a heap. You can actually hear it. The metal is sizzling. Listen to that. That is so damn cool. Now we also got a plasteel tank and a high ca capacity tank. I'm assuming both tanks are just better versions of the current tank. Let's actually see here. Uh, it, actually, this is an extra light tank, so it's just lighter. On the well, that's from what I understand, anyways. And then this one has extra air capacity as well, uh, so not a big deal with those. Just uh, essentially buffs. And then we have ultra glide fins, and then swim charge fin fins. Charges your held tool while you swim. That's actually really useful because there's a lot of tools coming out now that do have charge requirements, like the actual. Um, well, this rifle, the stasis rifle, and the new rifle as well, which is the propulsion cannon. So the tanks, not much has changed, uh, just the high-capacity tank has more, and then the plasteel tank is lighter. I'm assuming, therefore, you move faster. I'm just going to get rid of some of this crap here that I don't need. We'll just drop all of these. Oh, God. Are, what the fuck? I didn't realize those were so big. Oh, God. I, I should probably pick them up. Um, 
Oh, God. I did not mean to do that. I forgot. You know, I'm in my ship right now. I should keep it clean. Let's go on to the fins here. We got Ultra Glide fins, which obviously makes it faster to glide. And then we have Z Swim Charge fins, which charge your rifles. That's actually really useful. And then the Ultra Glide ones, I'm assuming, are faster. I can read it right here. Increased swim speed. Yeah, so very cool. We're going to check out what these knives do. That's what I'm curious about. Uh, we'll throw this, these fins, uh, the, the charge fins, in my inventory, or sorry, in my, my locker, and we'll get out of here. So we have two things to check out. This blade, and then this blade. Oh, this is, this does have a little, I think this, oh, hold on, let's just spawn in a knife. There, there we go. Let's see the differences here, um, compared to the three. We're gonna put, where is that knife? We'll put that on too. Okay, so it is definitely different. This is the ordinary knife. You can see it, it does look like an ordinary knife. And then this one just is a bit darker because it is diamond and it seems to reflect a few more things. And this one just looks so damn cool. All right, let's go down here and sh kill some things. Actually, where are we? I forget where we are. It's been a while. I did actually take a little break. So yeah, we are in the middle of nowhere. Let's actually drive this first to a zone where we can kill things and then we'll try out these knives. Oh, yes, this is actually who I wanted to fight. I, I did find one. All right, buddy, come here. There we go. Oh, didn't... Okay. Oh, it's taking a lot more hits than I expected. I did actually kill it really quickly, though. And we have a whale up there as well. Uh, that was about three or four hits. The old knife took probably 20. So that's a huge upgrade. The diamond blade is just said to be sharp as well, so probably more damage. Uh, I don't know which one's better. I want to say the diamond one probably, but this one just looks so freaking badass. I, I think this one's better just just by looks alone. All right, there is an alligator. These guys are not as strong as the other shark guys, but let's see how many hits it's going to take. That was one hit. That was two hits. That was three hits. That was four hits. So I don't know if the diamond's really that much of an upgrade in terms of... Uh, damage. Okay, he's still... What are you doing? <laughs> oh my god, he's headbanging with this thing. Okay, he is finally dead, so that was quite a few hits. Let's actually try this guy again. Oh god, don't... Okay, I didn't hit him. Didn't... Okay, I did hit him there. There we go. That's three, I think. It's really hard to tell because I'm trying to fight it as well while it's doing this. Um, come here. Come here. I just want to say hello. Okay, so... Probably about the same amount, if not a little less. So I don't really know what the diamond one's for. Maybe it is a downgrade. Let's actually go back to my ship and look at what it costs. That's what I'm curious about. Maybe the diamond one's easier to make. Actually, not not really. Diamonds are really hard to find. So this one takes a knife and a diamond. This one takes a knife and a battery, which is uh, really easy. And then the tanks, a tank and a lithium, uh, a tank and titanium. So these, these upgrades are quite easy to do. Fins and silicone, yep, easy. Fins and a wiring kit, easy as well. All those upgrades besides the diamond one are quite easy. But yeah, guys, I'm going to end this one here. That was just kind of a little update on what Subnautica is doing and what was in the update. We got uh, customizable ships now with colors. We got, of course, the cra or, sorry, the workbench station. I want to call it a crafting station, but that's already made. And then we have the upgrade modules for the Cyclops as well, and of course, the propulsion rifle. I forget, is it called a propulsion rifle? I want to say that. Propulsion cannon. A very cool rifle in the game. Definitely something that I'm excited to see. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Sonatica. Thank you so much for watching and liking, and I'll see you in the next one. Hey, this is just a quick message thanking you for watching my video. I hope it gave you literally minutes of enjoyment. If you want to see more, I've added playlists and videos like this one at the top right of your screen. If you want to follow me on Twitter, Facebook, or directly support me, all my social media and Patreon links are in the description of this video. Thanks for watching and liking. I'll see you in the next one.